The golden age of space exploration began with the development of several technological innovations that converged with the launch of Sputnik 1 by the Soviet Union on the 4th of October 1957. This was the world's first artificial satellite orbiting the Earth. The space age reached its peak with the Apollo program that was going to send the first humans on the moon. Over 500 million people around the world were watching the landing of Apollo 11. Beyond space exploration, the Apollo program contributed to several inventions and innovations that are still having an impact on our lives. NASA developed a small lightweight unit that purified water for human spaceflight. This turned out to be extremely useful for water purification on Earth as well. This technology used on the Apollo spacecraft is now employed in several spin-off applications to kill bacteria, viruses and algae in community water supply systems and cooling towers. The system has started to be used for cleaning pools too. Those breathing systems you see firefighters use, it's all because of NASA. The space agency itself did not invent them, but it was responsible for making them useful. In 1971, many US fire chiefs were complaining about their breathing gear being large and heavy, leading to some firefighters even abandoning their systems to reach the fire. Using its experience of developing astronaut equipment for the moon landing, NASA cooperated with the Fire Technology Division of the National Bureau to develop a better breathing system over the next few years. The upgraded system was lighter, easier to wear and also included a face mask allowing for a wider field of view. In order to bring rocks back to Earth and make some measurements while at the moon, the Apollo astronauts needed efficient cordless drills. The first cordless power tool was developed by Black & Decker in 1961. However, in the mid-1960s, Martin Marietta Corporation contracted with Black & Decker to develop more custom-designed tools for NASA, such as a cordless rotary hammer drill to take moon samples. For astronauts, it was too difficult to use a wrench to tighten bolts floating in zero gravity without spinning themselves around. This problem led to the development of the Zero Impact Wrench. So NASA helped initiate important innovation of cordless devices. In 